Alright, so this tutorial is on how to uh, upload your processing sketch onto our classroom site on openprocessing.org. Um, this is actually for those of you that have an image in your processing sketch. If you don't have an image, there's another video, um, probably a slightly simpler way to upload your, your sketch uh, if you don't have an image in it. So anyway, the first... Um, thing is if you've got your processing, processing sketch saved and it's got an image in it um, and we want to upload it to open processing well the first thing we're gonna have to do is actually sign up on openprocessing.org before we can even uh, think about turning this in so you most of you will have to go through the steps of signing up um, I suggest using your school username um, give yourself a password do use your full name because uh, that's what it'll show up on our classroom site as and if you don't use our your full name then I'm not gonna know who it is who turned it in again I recommend using your school email uh, you're gonna have to fill in the captcha um, but once you've done that you'll have to go to your email uh, to confirm that your account is your account and then you'll be able to log in and uh, turn in your processing sketch so once you're logged in you're, you're gonna be kind of at uh, you're really at your dashboard here at your, your portfolio and the first thing you're going to want to do is upload your sketch from processing. So, uh, you'll notice it tells you the step, step by step, what you need to do in order to upload it. So let's go back to the processing sketch there. Um, the first thing it says to do is we have to turn it to JavaScript mode. Right now we're in Java mode and my guess is a lot of you don't actually have JavaScript mode installed right now so you're gonna have to add a mode um, so there's the JavaScript mode uh, should pop up and you wanna install that that's gonna take just a second for it to download and to install it but it does go fairly quickly once it does that though um, you'll notice you don't immediately have JavaScript mode available in fact you're gonna have to uh, quit processing and then reopen processing in order to um, or reopen that sketch uh, it'll naturally open a blank one so you'll have to go to your sketchbook open up your sketch again um, so you have to reopen it and once you reopen it now you have JavaScript mode so there it is in JavaScript mode um, the next step that it says for me to do is to click export so there's that little export, export for the web. So I click export and what that does is it creates this little folder called web export which has my code, my picture, um, the HTML and uh, the JavaScript. So what I need to do is I need to right click and I need to compress the web export. What that does is it creates this file called web export dot zip. Now I can close this. Notice that's what it said to do, compress web export. And now I can choose that web export file. Uh, mine is going to be in our documents, processing, GRCHS football, there it is. Web export. I chose that file and I upload. Um, and I can check to make sure that it's working. In this case my picture is not showing up I'm actually not going to worry about it neither should you if your picture is not working right uh, at least for the sake of this assignment it could be because I'm using Google Chrome um, but I should give it a title I like my title GRCHS football and then I can say move your mouse around in my description so that people know to move the mouse around and to see the effect um, the other thing you might want to do is to um, to uh, create like a little thumbnail of your sketch so it's a, not quite as boring um, so that's nice to do you can hit capture button now and just hit crop um, so that it actually has a nice thumbnail then I can click save and now I have my actual uh, sketch on processing but I'm not on open processing sorry but I haven't yet turned it in 
The last step for me to turn it in is I'm going to have to go up here to Classrooms. I am going to search for our classroom. All of our classrooms start with the title GRCHS. There they are. There's a whole bunch of ours, GRCHS, and um, you go to your class, and then you have to submit a sketch from your portfolio. So I'm going to select a sketch. I pick the one that I want to add to our this collection. This one's a little bit nicer, so I'm going to add. Ah, what the heck? I'll add my football one. I click on that. It says sketch is added to the collection. Yay, and now I can see that Mr. Stapert has turned in two sketches in uh, this classroom of ours. So that's how you turn in, in your sketch. If you've got an image, uh, hopefully it works a little better than mine did, and the image actually does show up. Um, if it doesn't, for the sake of this assignment, let's not worry about it too much. Um, but if you do want to get it working, uh, please come see me during my office hours.